get a winning lottery ticket or give a winning lottery ticket. I mean, my parents, they're already millionaires, but a little extra cash never hurt. Excuse me, do you have any money? My parents abandoned me and I'm sorry, I, I shouldn't have bothered you. Wait, he needs this. I pick this one. Hey, wait up. Dude, wait, what's, what's that on the floor over there? Huh? What the heck? What is this? It looks like a lottery ticket. You should probably scratch it, you know, and see if you want anything. You think? Okay. No way. No freaking way! I won! Well, congrats. You should probably go cash that in. I just won a million dollars. <laughs> what was your name? Uh, my name's Jace. I'm Lindsay. It's really nice to meet you. Did you hear about the super attractive guy that transferred here? No. It doesn't matter. Rachel snatched him up anyways. Of course she did. She literally gets all the guys. Surprise! Hey! <laughs> Wait. Jace? Huh? Are you his friend? Well, I thought he was my friend. I just met her. Hey, what's this? That's not funny. This is special to me. Let go! Relax. No, dude, let go! Oh, poor baby. Whatever, she's no fun. Who wants to go shopping at Gucci with me? Me, me. I do. What happened to you? What can I say? Money changes people. You can be adopted by a single father or a single mother. Do you want to do single father? No. No men. Mean. Oh, okay. Miss, that's her over there. Why is she wearing a hospital gown? We found her in it and she won't take it off. Honey, this is the single mom that's gonna adopt you. Say hi. She doesn't know how to talk too well. Poor thing. Hi, I'm gonna be your mom. Mom? Yes, you're gonna come live with me now. Come on, let's go. Don't be scared. You can trust me. Honey, you're gonna have to change out of that. No. Yes, you need to. Sweetheart, please. Mom, maybe I can try and talk to her. Hi, I'm your new big sister. Sister? Yeah, do you want to come and maybe see my room and then we can... Oh, yeah, I'm real. <laughs> so, this is my room. Nice. Also here, I want to give you this. It's a tank top and it's super fuzzy and pretty. Pretty? Yeah, you should totally try it on. I think it would look super cute on you. See, you look so pretty. My mom said they found you on the side of the road. How did that- Bad men. Oh. Do you want to talk about- No? Okay. <sighs> Dinner's ruined, girls. The chicken's still frozen. I can help. What is she- <gasps> Oh my what gosh, oh my gosh! What is she- <gasps> Oh my what gosh, oh my gosh! How did she do she that? She has powers. Oh my god. Mad? No, no, honey. We're not mad. We're just a little shocked. No hurt. What? No, no one's gonna hurt you. Those bad men that you were telling me about, did they hurt you? Mom, it's probably because of her powers. That's horrible. Don't worry. We're gonna keep you safe here. So, can you do anything else, honey? Lift. Heavy. Can you show us what you mean? Whoa. Oh my gosh, she's lifting me up. That's incredible. Strong. Yes, you are very strong. Do you have any other powers that we should know about? One more. Wind. Wind? What is- Mom, I think she's trying to show us. Get out of the way. Oh, alright. She wants us to move. How is she doing that? Wow. I stay. Of course you can stay here, honey. But we can never tell anyone or show anyone your powers. Do you understand? Okay, good. Mom, why are you smiling so much? Don't tell me you're still talking to that guy. Well, I can't be a single mom forever. Would it be okay if I invited him over for dinner? It's fine with me, but- No, no men. Bad. Honey, men aren't all bad. He's gonna be here right now, honey. Can you please just give him a chance? I promise everything will be fine. The girls are down here. This is my friend Dan. Hey, how are you? The girls are down here. This is my friend Dan. Hey, how are you? Bad, bad man. Mean. Dan, I'm sorry. She has a fear of men. Oh, poor thing. Hey, it's okay. Oh, sweetie. Mom, maybe I should take her upstairs. You want to come with me? Come on, let's go. Poor kid. Don't you want to try to talk to him? No, I fight. I kill him. <gasps> hey, stop. 
You can't do that. I didn't mean to yell, but you can't hurt people with your powers. Hey, kid, I was telling your mom that I'm a therapist and I'd like to help you. Lie. Can I have some time alone to talk to her? Sure, Dan. She really needs help. It's okay. You're gonna be fine. We'll just be a few minutes. Hey, look at me. I really missed you. Hey, watch it. You know what happens when you act up. I spent a long time looking for you. What happened to your mom because she didn't listen? Dead. So what do you think's gonna happen to your new mom if you don't listen? Dead. So what are you gonna say when we go out there? Nothing. Good girl. Dan, are you sure about this? I'm just gonna take her for a relaxing car ride to get her used to me, you know? Honey, are you sure that's okay? She's fine with it. Right? Finally, we're back to the lab. Now give me that. <sighs> no. Ugh, I forgot how strong you are. Let go, or you're going to the mean doctor. Okay, kid, now you're gonna have to change back into this. Keep? No, that goes off. Please? I said take it off. Now go change. I change. I told you to take off that- Laura, hey. Mom. You say one word and you're done. I'm gonna take the phone off mute and you're gonna stay silent. Dan, is everything okay? Sorry about that. Yeah, she's doing great. Oh, really? Help. Honey? Sweetheart? Sorry, Laura. She- Oh! Ugh! Oh. Oh, you broke my hand, you little- oh. Oh. I escape again. Oh. Honey, someone please answer me. Mom, come find- What? What's happening? Mom, Dan probably kidnapped her. Sissy, where are you? Sweetie, where are you? Room. Okay, honey, we need more details. What does it look like? White. Mom, she barely knows how to talk. Okay, um, do you know how to dial 911? I... Sorry, Laura. You won't be seeing her anymore. Hurt. Dan, what did you do? Goodbye. Honey. Doctor, I, I found the girl, but we gotta hurry up because she's gonna wake up any minute. They'll look who's waking up. I heard you have been a very bad girl today. You have broken Dr. Dan's hand, so now you must wear restraints. You will not escape ever again. Let. Me. Go. Watch out for lasers! Get the glasses, quickly! Bad kid. Hurry, doctor, put them on. No, no. That sedation is not strong enough for her. We're gonna have to get her with the tranquilizer. I'd be good, please. No, you are going to sleep. We need more blood. Okay, let's go get the equipment. Honey, I'm here. I tracked Dan's phone. What did they- Hey, get uh, away from her. Uh, Dan, stop it. You shouldn't have come here, Laura. Uh, how could you do this? Mom. Sorry, kid, but I'm gonna have to get rid of your new mom now. And you'll be too weak to stop me. No. I. Strong. That's right, honey. Get him. No, stop. Oh. Mouth is going- oh. You. Dead. Oh my gosh, Mom. I'm okay, honey. Mom. Sissy. You fine. Yeah, we're so happy we found you. Come here, honey. Hold my hand. We go home? Yeah, we're gonna go- <gasps> Mom, there's a man in that glass tank. Dad! He dead. Oh my! Mom, it kinda looks like he's- Oh, he's alive! There's a man in that glass tank. Dad! That's your father? He dead. Oh my! I don't know, it kinda looks like he's still- <sighs> He's alive! Menere, Sen. Sir, we don't understand you. Apana! No! Bien dare! Kill! Ma! Sa! Family! Huh? No hurt. No hurt. Speak English. Sir, we're just trying to help. You help. Yes, I care for your daughter. She adapt. Sissy, it's called adopt. Adopt me. Huh. New mother. She's pretty. Apan. <laughs> what is she saying? She thinks that I should be your husband. <laughs> well, she is a single mother. Honey, stop. Mom, we go home? They have helped us enough. We leave them alone. Sir, we don't mind. We want to keep you safe. See, they nice. Fine, we shall go with them. Yay! There's the exit. I can't open. I still weak. Get back. He just ripped off the door. How did he? He very strong. Guess you got your jeans from him. <laughs> Mom, I hungry. Kara, how do we say it the right way? I am hungry. Good, what do you want? Mac and cheese. <laughs> Sissy, help me warm it up. Okay. She is cute. I think she gets it from you. Someone has a crush. <laughs> Your total's 20 even. Babe, 
I'm so sorry. I don't think I have enough. Hey, it's okay. I got it. Sorry if I embarrassed you back there. No, you're fine. I understand you're going through a tough time with your job. Tomorrow when the amount in my bank account appears, it might come as a bit of a shock to you. Listen, I don't care how low that number is. I'm gonna love you just the same. Poor thing, it's time to see how little he has. What? My boyfriend is a billionaire? No, there has to be some sort of mistake. I, uh, take it you saw my account? Yeah, and you've got a lot to explain. Whose Ferrari is in our driveway? That's mine. Well, actually, it's going to be yours now. What? No, I am still mad at you. Come with me and I'll explain everything. There was a good reason for me lying. Oh yeah? Was there a good reason for you having me buy your meals for the past year? Heck, I even paid your rent one time. I know, I know. And I'll be paying you back for all of it. Why didn't you just tell me? Because every girl I've ever dated has used me for my money. I was tired of dating gold diggers, and I wanted to find a girl who liked me for me. I promise, I will make it all up to you, and I'm going to start by showing you where I really live. Whoa, now hold up. You have a Chick-fil-A in your kitchen? Yep, and there's a McDonald's upstairs. <laughs> Babe, who are you, Richie Rich? Excuse me for just a moment. This is crazy. One of my stocks just went up. A lot. Yeah, actually, I can see that. Why don't you look happy? I'm worried about your safety. You can't tell anyone that you're dating a billionaire. Why can't people know I'm dating a billionaire? Because I'm now one of the youngest billionaires alive. And is that a bad thing? I know a lot of people that would die to get their hands on my money. And you think they'll come after me? I know they will. Promise me you won't tell anyone about my money. Okay, I promise, but you do owe me quite a bit of cash, so what do you say you take me on a little shopping spree? Well, I can't be seen buying you a bunch of stuff, but I can give you this. Babe, this is like 10k. You didn't owe me this much. I know. Consider it a thank you for being so kind to me. I want you to spoil yourself. Oh, hey, Lizzie. Where's your boyfriend? He's at his house. Why? Oh, nothing. I just think it's kind of sad how he never buys you anything. I mean, look at all the stuff you had to buy yourself. It must be hard to date someone poor. Actually, he's not poor. He's one of the richest people alive. What? <gasps> did you enjoy your shopping spree? Uh, yeah, sure did. Good. I also bought you this necklace. Babe, it's beautiful. Thank you. Delivery for Elizabeth? Yes, how much do I owe you? Oh, it's not you who's gonna owe me money. It's your boyfriend. Lizzie, it's 1 a.m. Why are you up? This isn't Lizzie, but if you want to see her again, you're gonna do exactly as I said. You want me to wire you one billion dollars? Yeah, do it now or she's gone. No, I'll send it. It's done. Now let me speak to her. Okay, talk. Liam, I'm so sorry. This is all my fault. I accidentally told someone that you were... It's okay. I planned for this. Remember that necklace I gave you? Yeah. It's a tracker, babe. No! Please, freeze! Thank you, Liam. I'm glad you were able to get your money back. I don't care about the money. I'm just happy you're okay. Your total's 20 even. Babe, I'm so sorry. I don't think I have enough. Hey, it's okay. I got it. Sorry if I embarrassed you back there. No, you're fine. I understand you're going through a tough time with your job. Tomorrow when the amount in my bank account appears, it might come as a bit of a shock to you. Listen, I don't care how low that number is. I'm gonna love you just the same. Poor thing, it's time to see how little he has. What? My boyfriend is a billionaire? No, there has to be some sort of mistake. I, uh... Take it you saw my account? Yeah, and you've got a lot to explain. Whose Ferrari is in our driveway? That's mine. Well, actually, it's going to be yours now. What? No, I am still mad at you. Come with me and I'll explain everything. There was a good reason for me lying. Oh yeah? Was there a good reason for you having me buy your meals for the past year? Heck, I even paid your rent one time. I know, I know. And I'll be paying you back for all of it. Why didn't you just tell me? Because every girl I've ever dated has used me for my money. I was tired of dating gold diggers, and I wanted to find a girl who liked me for me. I promise, I will make it all up to you, and I'm going to start by showing you where I really live. 
Whoa, now hold up. You have a Chick-fil-A in your kitchen? Yep, and there's a McDonald's upstairs. <laughs> Babe, who are you, Richie Rich? Excuse me for just a moment. This is crazy. One of my stocks just went up. A lot. Yeah, actually, I can see that. Why don't you look happy? I'm worried about your safety. You can't tell anyone that you're dating a billionaire. Why can't people know I'm dating a billionaire? Because I'm now one of the youngest billionaires alive. And is that a bad thing? I know a lot of people that would die to get their hands on my money. And you think they'll come after me? I know they will. Promise me you won't tell anyone about my money. Okay, I promise, but you do owe me quite a bit of cash, so what do you say? You take me on a little shopping spree? Well, I can't be seen buying you a bunch of stuff, but I can give you this. Babe, this is like 10K. You didn't owe me this much. I know. Consider it a thank you for being so kind to me. I want you to spoil yourself. Oh, hey, Lizzie. Where's your boyfriend? He's at his house. Why? Oh, nothing. I just think it's kind of sad how he never buys you anything. I mean, look at all the stuff you had to buy yourself. It must be hard to date someone poor. Actually, he's not poor. He's one of the richest people alive. What? Did you enjoy your shopping spree? Uh, yeah, sure did. Good. I also bought you this necklace. Hey, it's beautiful. Thank you. Delivery for Elizabeth? Yes, how much do I owe you? Oh, it's not you who's gonna owe me money. It's your boyfriend. Lizzie, it's 1 a.m. Why are you up? This isn't Lizzie, but if you want to see her again, you're gonna do exactly as I say. You want me to wire you one billion dollars? Yeah, do it now or she's gone. No, I'll send it. It's done. Now let me speak to her. Okay, talk. Liam, I'm so sorry. This is all my fault. I accidentally told someone that you were... It's okay. I planned for this. Remember that necklace I gave you? Yeah. It's a tracker, babe. No! Please, please! Thank you, Liam. I'm glad you were able to get your money back. I don't care about the money. I'm just happy you're okay. Please, don't be my bank account. I really don't need him to see how broke I am. My hand? Wait, which one? Oh, okay, guess it's this one then. <laughs> yeah, this is gonna be weird. I don't know what to wear. Okay, very funny genius, but I have class today, so no. Oh, actually, this could work. <gasps> Are you kidding me? Okay, that was pretty cute, so I guess I won't be mad at him, but he owes me a new lipstick. Does anyone know the answer to letter A? No, I don't. Yes? Um, 22? Correct. Good job. Hey, beautiful. What do you say you come with me? Don't be scared. Come on. <laughs> I just knocked somebody out. Or, I guess you did. Okay, yeah, I should probably go. Morning. I just want to say thank you for protecting me like that yesterday. So, I guess you can hear and see everything that I do? Well, guess I'll take that as a yes. <laughs> hey, would you stop that? Hey, Mia. Hi. I, uh, I like your dress. Oh, thanks. Can I have your snap? Yeah, sure, it's... Are you... are you good? Yeah, sorry about that. Why don't I just add you? Okay, my username is... What the... Actually, never mind. That was so embarrassing. Moo! Ow! Oh, I barely even pushed... <gasps> I am so sorry. Do you know how much this outfit was? No. Of course you don't, you idiot. Did you just... No, I... Zip it! You are gonna pay for my dry cleaning! Why are you so aggressive? I'm just trying to look out for you. Well, please tone it down because you're gonna get me in trouble. On my way, we're gonna party hard tonight. I am so excited. Okay, I'll be waiting. Come on, girl, let's go. Um, <laughs> let go of the door. I can't. Oh, I see what you're doing. No, I'm being serious. My soulmate, he's- Save it. You should have told me you didn't want to come. No, Sarah, wait. Thanks for wasting my gas. 
You know, I thought I asked you to tone it down. I don't need you to be acting like a, a parent to me. This is getting really annoying. When do I get to control him? Want to switch and control your soulmate? Yes. You will control your soulmate's hand with your mind. You will now be able to see and hear everything your soulmate does. Some things will be censored for privacy reasons. Oh, that's a relief. Are you ready to switch now? Yes. She's in control of me now? Great! Just don't do anything dirty. <gasps> Ow! Jeez, I was just kidding! Oh, this is so fun. Ready for the concert? I sure am. Who is she? Oh, no he doesn't. Whoa! You good? Oh, I'm fine. <laughs> Chill, this is my sister. Whoops. Damn, and I thought I was overprotective. Sorry, I guess we both kind of are. 